The European season is over and Formula One moves to Singapore for the last round of flyway races. Together with Alberto Antonini, head of Scuderia Ferrari press office, we reviewed the main features of the Marina Bay circuit. Um, the last two races were held on uh, super fast tracks, Spa and Monza. We now move it to a completely uh, different kind of circuit, which is a straight circuit, and uh, consequently the average speed will be much lower and we often uh, have been close to the two hours limit in the race. Uh, the main feature of uh, uh, Singapore circuit uh, is actually braking and traction. Braking is, uh, makes it one of the most demanding tracks in the calendar, not because braking are so heavy, although some of the uh, braking points are really uh, put a stress on, the, on brakes themselves, but also because it's very difficult to keep the right temperature for discs and calipers in between the uh, braking points uh, and it's just because uh, there's a uh, continued sequence of, uh, of braking points. So that would be uh, one of the issues to uh, carefully look at. Together with traction, which is uh, uh, obviously uh, another theme of this track, uh, given the number of uh, slow uh, 90 degrees corner. Uh, whether that makes uh, the Scuderia uh, whether that puts in a position to uh, be more competitive. We certainly hope to be competitive there, but uh, we won't know exactly until we get to the track and see what the conditions are. Singapore is a night race. What does this imply in terms of track activity? Well, uh, a few team members may have to stick to local Asian time on, uh, on the first day on Wednesday, but uh, for most of the weekend, and especially as far as drivers are concerned, you simply do not set the clock, uh, do not set your watch to, uh, to local time, you just stick to European time. And uh, that means that you have to uh, wake up uh, late in the morning, have your breakfast, you go to the circuit uh, in the early afternoon, and you stay there until uh, into the wee hours of the morning. Uh, that may be, uh, look a bit strange at the beginning, but uh, uh, as years go by, uh, this Grand Prix having been held uh, uh, for a number of years now, uh, you quickly get used to that. So will Scuderia Ferrari approach the Singapore weekend in a different way? Not at all, it's just another weekend, another race weekend, and uh, we will approach it with the same approach we always held throughout the season, which is uh, feet firmly on the ground, keeping the herd down, and working as hard as we can to be able to ensure uh, the maximum result for both uh, Sebastian and Kimi.